Through COVID-19 situation in Thailand, several hospitals in Bangkok now have suspended PCR swab tests because they are concerned that if some test positive for COVID-19, they will have no beds to accommodate them. Others have scaled down the service because their staff are overloaded. This is according to Dr. Supacho Lab of Mahidon University, Faculty of Medicine of Rama Tibeti Hospital. Meanwhile, Professor Dr. Thirawat Hemajutha, head of the Thai Red Cross Emerging Infectious Diseases Health Science Center, said that Jilai Longkorn Hospital has suspended COVID-19 swab tests for four days from today because if some test positive, there are no beds available. He said that there are still patients arriving at the ER and several of them have developed lung infections, but no beds are available. And that several other hospitals are experiencing the same problem. He also pointed out that the several field hospitals in the deep red zone are operating and are even equipped with ventilators for severe cases. But the problem is fighting doctors and nurses. He warned Thai people not to lower their guard, even if they are fully inoculated because they can still get infected and everyone is vulnerable. In his Facebook post today, Dr. Supachok noted that due to fewer swab tests being conducted at the hospitals, the daily new infection rate recorded at more than 4,000 cases in the past few days may not reflect the real situation as actual infections may be much higher. He also doubted the government's claim that the hospital bed management system is functioning smoothly, asking why there are still cases of the infected people who cannot be admitted and have been waiting for three to four days. He pointed out that each severe case normally occupies an ICU bed for two to four weeks, and sometimes as long as two months for those who need a ventilator, adding that even if more field hospitals are established and fully equipped, there won't be enough medical personnel to man them. Dr. Supercho also questioned the efficacy of the Chinese medicine Sinovac, one of the two vaccines being administered by the government in Thailand, asking why some countries which have vaccinated their people with Sinovac have had to reimpose lockdown measures and why research work on the vaccine has not been publicly disclosed. And that's all the news we have in this edition of Thai PBS World Tonight. You can follow our website to see more other kind of news, uh, worldwideweb.thaipbsworld.com, or you can also follow our social media, Facebook, Twitter, YouTube, uh, Instagram, and also TikTok. Thanks for watching. Stay safe, and we'll see you tomorrow. Swadika. Swadika. ทั้งหมดคือข่าวภาคภาษาอังกฤษจากไทย PBS